So on this screen is where you can see the mentor, right? So the first page I'd like to showcase here is the launch page. So basically, you know, those are, uh, this is basically a standalone environment. I was involved, you know, uh, even before the mentor acquisition, uh, developing some enable material for the mentor integration. So basically we leveraged the standalone environment. Uh, we are not using the call pack for data version. So the main thing here is where we are interested is the admin UI. So this is where you can make, you know, setting up the connection against the source system as well as the target system. So in this particular demo instance, right, as you can see here, uh, I have setting up connection against DB2, uh, PostWord SQL, and in terms of the data integration tool, you know, I have set up connection against a data stage instance as well as the talent in instance and the reporting MBI to, you know, uh, Tableau or SAS. So those are the various connection to can be set up. And then how do we tie it together? I talk about the concept of a scenario, right? So what happens if I have a scenario, you know, bringing data from PostgreSQL, SQL, doing some kind of transformation, and eventually bring that data into a downstream Tableau or Tableau BI report, right? So that will be considered as a workflow. So I'm going to search an existing workflow. It's called a GDPR. So as you can see here, whenever I specify a workflow, right, there will be a workflow designer associated with that. So this is where I specify where I'm going to extract the data, the source system, right, as well as the target, and also the middle tier. That's the data goes through any transformation, and then. In this case, right, I'm using data stage doing the data transformation, and the data is coming from the Postgres SQL, and eventually I bring the data into a Tableau database. And also a second stage, right? So the extraction is basically extracting the metadata, and the analysis is basically goes through the end analysis based on the metadata and also based on the specification you provide, you know, associated with the ETO job, Manta can figure out the transformation happen against the metadata level. And once I define the process manager, I can execute this, right? And the end result is basically, you can you, you can physically viewing this uh, in another UI, it's called a flow viewer. So basically, you know, this is, tie with my early workflow, right? I'm using a data stage. So I'm going to add that to my uh, graphical representation. And I'm dealing with the Postgres SQL database. And I'm only interested in the table set under the GDPR uh, schema name. And then for the Tableau, so that's the downstream BI report system I'm using. And here are a lot of different parameters can be set up. So I'm only interested in showing, seeing the lineage information. So here I'm just going to kick in this and showcase the lineage information. So as you can see here, you know, this is basically the lineage information. What happens if I'm, you know, highlighting a particular column from a Tableau BI report, right? So you can see where the data is coming from. The blue represent the upstream system, and the red is basically representing the downstream system. And also, you can zoom in and see what kind of transformation had happened at the column level. And that is really a very quick demonst demonstration on the how does mental works. 